Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll show you how to insert a picture into your page. As usual, you need to go into edit mode of the page that you want to insert your image to. And then you simply put the cursor where you want the image. And you go to the insert tab and select picture. And here you have three options. You have from computer, from address or from SharePoint. The from computer is the easiest one, of course. That's if you've ever added a picture to your Facebook or so, then you, it's the same principle. You just upload this. And as you notice, the destination library, in this case, is the site collection images, but you also have the site assets, which is the default library in most cases. And that's library where your image will be placed. And of course, a link will be placed in the page. So linking to that site assets library. So when I upload that, I get the picture right there. And here's, as you see, when I click on that image, I get these selectors, these handles. And when those are visible, when I have the image selected, I can also go into the image tab here and I can see the address where the image is. And as you'll notice, it's put that in the site assets where I selected it and it's created a subfolder called site pages. And underneath that is another subfolder called home, which is the home ASPX page I'm editing. And then it's the name of the file. And of course, change that. Then you have the, the usual things here. You can change the picture, of course. That changes the existing picture into something else. You have the image styles and you have a couple of borders. Some of these are rather dark. Um, but I think this one looks rather nice. You can also play around with the position. If you're used to working with PowerPoint, you might want to just take the picture and drag it up here. But that doesn't work in SharePoint at all. If you want to place it up there, there are two options. Either you change the position and float it to the right, like that. It still floats in connection with the text. So it's not really free floating in terms of PowerPoint free floating. If you really want control over where your images are placed, you can either do it with CSS, which is kind of complicated, or you can do it with a table. I'm going to show you how to do that. So if you want a table, I'll just insert a table here like that. And now you want it up there. Drag and drop doesn't work. In this case, it doesn't. I'll just do control X to cut it out and then place my cursor in here and do control V to paste it in here. And there's my picture. And of course, I can hide the in the table design here. I can hide the style so it's clear. So it's covering out there um, as I intended it to. So that concludes my first demo on adding pictures to a web page. What I've shown here is adding a picture from your computer and also how to place that picture and also some of the styles available. Thank you for watching this demo.